Hello and welcome back to Dark Souls. Woo! Haven't played in a while. So, let's see. One more into Vitality, I guess. Yeah, that's it. Let's go. Good. Last time we got ourselves imprisoned. Um, I've already put on the, the ring again. Good. So, we need to break out and we need to kill Seath. Um, other things are currently not really important because I'm not planning to do any kind of mage build. So I couldn't care less about um, Logan. I might still free him because of the... Can't open this right now. <laughs> Why would I be able to open this? I'm a prisoner here. Um, maybe I care about the... the the soul the firekeeper so uh, kill the snake grab the key watch the cutscene once you go out and here comes the very annoying sound amazing not even loud In this game. You come over here. They want to flee because they just unleashed the. Oh my god. Okay, at least I got one. Good enough. Uh, let's just. That is better for now. If I remember, I turn on the sound um, back on again, once I'm done with this shit. Well, the dangerous part about them is their grab attack. That didn't really grab me the first time there. But honestly, that's probably not killing me. I'm too tanky right now. That's first thing you want to do is turn that shit off. Because it not only makes them aggressive, it also makes you aggressive. Um, or not. Maybe maybe you just get a headache. I don't know. I definitely do. And, well, on the way there are more of these uh, the tentacle snakes. Whatever they're called, don't care. I know, you have a grab attack. Oh, this one grabbed me. <laughs> Third? Maybe. Okay, it doesn't even matter. And oh! Who got themselves in prison? Excuse me. I just healed myself. Rude. That was rude. Now get out of me, what the fuck? These are the only ones that are not aggressive, but these are also the only ones that drop you uh, miracles, so... But they also have more HP. There we go. Soothing and bountiful sunlight, and here we have Logan. Hello! Hello again. What a chance meeting this is. Alas, I'm imprisoned once again. I don't suppose you could stage me a getaway. The archives. Such a storehouse of knowledge. So close, but just out of reach. The thought offends me, so I could simply die. As a student of the arts, you understand me, yeah? I'm not a student of the arts. Hello again. Whatever. First thing that I'm doing is definitely turning that shit off now. What I was always wondering here, we have this big ass library, right? Like, look how many books there are. Um, and then for some reason there are also prison cells inside of these bookshelves, which is a weird concept. 
but I didn't build this thing. Like, how's a normal person supposed to get on the books that are that high up? How am I supposed to get on that book there? On, on, on that bookshelf? A bit to the right, this one. How am I supposed to get to that book? You don't know. Magic. Well, the only magic I know is shooting various missiles at, at things. I don't know how to levitate. I, I just can... I, I just can destroy. That's the only thing I can do with magic, so... Wait, we got a key and a chest. And we turned that shit off, so... Now we have in-game sound again. Isn't that great? Now I can hear my character walking again. With, without getting deafened by that music instrument. So now we can open various doors here. I don't even know which one... Well, what, what doors I can open here. I'm always wondering, what is that shit down there? Is that art? Modern art? Some gears. They, they don't seem to do anything. Like, is this built for, for people or for a dragon? Knock knock. Oh, come on. Man, I really hate this shit hitting... Bouncing off of walls here. Yeah, this is the most aggravating stuff in, in in every game to me. Because that happened to me so often in Lords of the Fallen and happens to me in this game. Ugh. Enemies don't bounce off of walls. Why do I have to? Well maybe they do and I didn't didn't notice it thus far. That just a random ass shield. Uh, I just was in that cell, so. How was I? I was. <laughs> Can't remember. What was that prompt? I can close it again, okay. Understandable. Have a nice day. So, are you expecting me to take, take a ladder to get to these books? I'm not climbing up. Are they walking backwards? Fuck. I'm not taking a ladder to grab a book. Like It's high as fuck. It looks dangerous as fuck. No thank you. Don't wanna do that. I'd rather not read that book. Okay, that is player's prison cell. Open up. Hello. Goodbye. Next game that I'm definitely playing through on this channel is Lords of the Fallen. Man, I just, I, I just like that game. It's so fun to me. And I kind of wanna, wanna start now, but I also wanna finish this. Technically, I could stagger them or upload two episodes at a, during a day. Or something similar to that, but I don't know. I don't want to burn through every option and then I'm just sending here. What do I play now? I'd rather not do that yet. This might come later at some point during the lifetime of this channel where I'm wondering what I'm going to play at some point. But right now I have enough Souls games to play through. And technically it's a boulder skate at some point. But um, uh, right now I, I don't want to play boulder skate again. I've planned another playthrough with a friend of mine when they're done playing with another friend. I don't know. Kind of weird, but... And I'm already burned out, so I'm, I'm kind of glad that we're not playing right now. And I'm also glad that I'm not playing that game at this time on this channel because, I don't know. That's the problem with Baldur's Gate, with every story-driven game, basically. You just... 
know everything and then the the dialogues are partially boring at least to me that's uh, that's the problem I that I have with these games at least in this game you can I don't know you're more active right Baldur's game is a strategy game you don't have you don't have to be your hand-eye coordination doesn't need to be good in order to play that game. You just need a lot of knowledge, right? In this game, you also need a lot of knowledge. Like, it's not that difficult, Dark Souls 1. For fuck's sake. <laughs> I was too careful there. Here we go again. Alright, the snakes. Hello. Goodbye. Ah, no, that's not goodbye. At least not now. Ah, you're getting backstabbed here. I think that's, that's, that's not that difficult. This game is fairly slow. And you can be slow and methodical in this game. It's not as lightning fast as uh, Bloodborne, for example. You don't need to be as precise. Which is great. But also... Well... Nothing really, but... Uh, this game is old, and it feels old. And I know all this stuff, that's the problem, right? Especially with... Uh, yeah, that's better. That was a good landing. That's the problem with, with Border Skate, right? When, once you've played through it a few times, you know everything, and then... It's just the combat that drives you, at least for me. For me, it's the combat that I... That I like in these games. I'm not, I'm not playing these games anymore for story. And sure, in Border Skate you have like... You have a lot of different things you can do but the base game is the same thing the encounters are mostly mostly the same maybe there's one or two surprises but it's just not worth it at some point anymore i'm definitely glad that i didn't start another playthrough for this channel at least because I couldn't stop that. I would feel bad stopping a playthrough that some people might enjoy. But I don't mind stopping my own playthrough if I no longer have fun. My play private playthrough. Okay, we are fine. Oh, for fuck's sake. Stop dancing, you idiot. So this is now a bit difficult. I'm definitely not going to get the Evelyn on the other side. I I, I don't care about the Evelyn. Like it's a good crossbow, but it's like when when you when you miss the spot, then then the can you stop that, you idiot? Holy shit, are they annoying. I'm gonna deal with that archer first. Then I'm gonna deal with you. Oh, you're already here. Holy shit. And this is the exact game design that people are bitching about in... ...in Lords of the Fallen. But in this game it's different, because this game is slower. So it works in this game. And lots of the fun. You have similar encounters to these, but uh, but that game is faster, so the enemies are also faster. So it doesn't work as well. That's the difference. Not partially the difference, of course. There, are, there are more things that are different. But, but to be honest, the encounters in in, in the archives here are like, is this fun? This is not fun. No one can tell me that the archives are fun. 
Like, you might not hate it, but you definitely do not enjoy it. Or is it great? Is, is this great? Maybe you might uh, you might want to answer this. Do you do you find this peak gameplay? Is this your favorite level? If yes, why? Why is it your favorite level? Or one of your favorites even? Please answer that because I can't understand it. I mean, you can't even f look through that window or whatever that is. Is there a window? There are archers everywhere. There's another archer. Great. Do you have more than one enemy type? And over there is another thing. What even is that? Oh, it's another archer. Then I looked strange from afar. Okay, now I'm, now I'm up here. I just flipped the platforms. Um, now I can go down there. Let's see, is there something in this corner? Oh no, there is not. Is there something in that corner? Oh, it looks like there is a chest there. I wonder what is in the chest. Hopefully nothing useless. Ah, oh, goddammit. Actually, that's kind of useful. But I've been here, I've been now on all four levels on, on this side of the thingy. Now let's go over there. Because we remember I was... I started from underneath me, basically. I started from down here, like one, one level lower. Okay, how do we do this? He shot, now I'm jumping down. And he wants to teleport. Oh no, he does. Oh, 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 he couldn't teleport. Oh, he, could, he didn't teleport. Unlucky. And... Hey, sorcery, who cares? I don't. I don't care about sorceries. And over here is nothing. And then I've been in that in that area I've been already. Or yeah. There, over there. So let's turn this one and finally get to the other side here. The only area that I haven't been at. Right now, let's see, is there something over there? No, unlucky. Maybe on the other side. No, ah, god damn it. Time to take out the bow. Can't aim at him for some reason. Feels good to get shot by arrows, does it? Amazing. Uh, I technically could jump over there, but I don't want to fall down. You can jump over here. Woo! I don't know why the camera is shaking when I'm when I'm flying down the, the thingy here. Uh, do I need to free Logan? Do I even have the key? What is it even called? Where's there? That's how I get to the key items. No, Master Key, no, no. Mm-hmm. Okay, no, no. Light turn, you learn the ruins, cage. Archive, tower, cell key. Archive, prison, extra key. Archive, tower, giant door key. <laughs> like the key names, or I probably can open his, his cell, but... Why would I? The idiots are respawning, so... Hmm. 
If I'm using homeward now, would I go back to this bonfire or the one that I rested at? I don't know. I'm just being careful. Because I'm running back to Logan now. For fuck's sake. Let me through. The idiots are back. Well, I haven't been here. For fuck's sake. Right, I need to go one more up, so technically, if I have a look at this one, there could be a chest here. No chest there. But there could be something here. Maybe, hopefully. And what is that here if there's nothing? There is nothing here. What a waste of time. Holy shit. Like this area just feels so empty. Except the thousand enemies that are in here, but that doesn't count. Don't care. For fuck's sake. Worst feeling ever. Stop dancing, idiot. You're about to die. That's not. That's nothing to celebrate, at least not for you. Nope, wrong side. This way. So we're gonna go on this thing, I guess. For fuck's sake, I hate it. What the fuck was this animation? Why is he sh trying to shoot through the wall and why is he partially succeeding? Probably because the level inside despawned. Woo! Bonk. Let's go! Maybe, if I'm quick enough, I'm doing the archives in this episode. The only thing, the only area where I... Like per area, probably one to two episodes max. I don't think I need more than two episodes per area, except for maybe the DLC. Maybe. And even there, if I'm quickly, if I'm quick, then I'm... The thing is with the DLC, I'm, I'm, I'm probably not going to try to pick up everything single item, but the DLC is probably three, three episodes. And with the end of the DLC, I probably... I know, I, then I have to beat the four kings. But why? Just to get the... The extra... Oh, who followed me? Hmm. Hello. Oh, for fuck's sake. Come on. Why is the snake dude down already? Okay, wait a second. They're both! The fuck? Why do I all of the sudden trigger them? That never happened in the, in the other version. Okay. Give me that. Okay, forget it. Nope. Nope. I don't have the key. 
The key is probably in one of these chests over here. Right? This chest? Why is it so fucking dark in here? What the fuck? This is a lighting error. Oh, that's not the key. But why, why the fuck is it so dark in here? Uh, not a mimic. Okay, that's uh, this set. That is one mimic. That is not a mimic. Archive tower, giant cell key. Enchanted Falcon, Fulgion, whatever. Crystal Amber, finally. I'm, I'm not going back there. Nah, Logan can... Uh, can go F himself, I guess. But the Firekeeper, oh, who cares about the Firekeeper, so... I don't. I just wasted my time walking there. Because for some reason I thought I got the key. Made no sense, but... Oh yeah, there's so many gears. I know it to repair the music instrument. Because that what was Sif's favorite music. So because it's now golem time, I think I can wrong direction again. Let's do a quick row. Okay. One, two. Good. That's the yellow golem there. The yellow one is there. Are there even items here? There's one item. One. Oh. Three, okay. Probably just dealt critical damage to the first one because he jumped away. That's why I could kill him in... Uh, uh, nah. Get over here. Quicker. Quicker. Ooh, that staggered you. Okay, guess what? I have no patience. Come on. Amazing pathing. Just amazing pathing, holy shit. Hello, good sir. It's definitely a bigger golem than the other ones, aren't they? Ouch. Rude. Rude, holy shit. Down one flask now. Yeah, I wanted to kick that. Uh, I wanted to kick that golem, very important. Hello there. It was you who rescued me. Why, thank you. I am Vigeland of Katarina. I don't know how I ended up in that crystal. It wasn't terrible in there, but I could hardly move. I must think of some way to repay you. How do you even get trapped in that crystal to begin with? You wouldn't miss him. A suit of armor just like mine. In fact, yes, I have seen him. Thank goodness. I knew he was here somewhere. Well then, now I must find him. Thanks again, truly. Now if we'll just stay put and keep out of trouble. You too, I guess? Thank good. Well then, now if we'll just... Whatever. 
Do whatever you want. Nah. Ah. Give me that. Crystalline gauntlet. Can I survive the run through there? I'm just running through, alright? Are you ready? Running through the whole area. No, not really through the whole area, but... I... You do you guys, whatever. Let's go into this... Crystal thing. The crystal cave, of course, of course. It's a cave. Don't you see that? It's a cave. Very deep. Looks amazing though. Has some bullshit mechanics though. As we can see here. Completely see-through crystal apparently. Just to grab an item. Now we have the moon, moon, moonlight butterflies here that we actually don't have to fight, which is good. Guess I don't want to fight them. And then we even have a developer message here. That says you can uh, path ahead. Amazing. I love this path ahead. I don't want to fight this golem. Okay, big boy. Wanna jump? Uh, how do I do this? It's definitely a stronger one. Can I just run past you? Thank you. This is always very insane here. Now we can just drop down this path. And ooh, there are a bunch of crystal dudes. Ooh, I got one. Oh, I got two actually. Oh shit, he followed me. Oh, you can't get in here. I hope you like cheese, because I do. I love cheese, especially crystal. I made out of crystals, I guess. Amazing. And here comes another one. Definitely more safer version here. And then, um... What if I could drop down there? Then I can run up there again, right? Uh, let's just do this. What's that? Not worth it. That wasn't worth it. Eee, run up there, just in a straight line, I hope. And it's very broad here. Is there actually a video where someone explores this thing and somehow manages to color the the walkways here. That would be interesting to watch what the actual layout is. I know there are some videos where they made uh, like a path out of uh, out of the prism stones, but I mean is there someone who who colored someone who colored these walkways? That would be interesting to see. I'm missing currently one item that is uh, like when I walk through here where the crystal lizards are somewhere over there which is a slab so you have to go for that slab if you want the 100% achievement trophy thing or if you want an enchanted weapon plus um, plus five or so but Plus five. What am I talking? Like the max upgrade material for for some magic shit. What was that attack? Holy shit! Stop hurting me, man! They are so tanky. So tanky. Because you, oh, he dropped something. Very nice. You know I need some HP for that boss and some healing. On the other hand, I could just throw a few of these. Uh, maybe not so worth it. Is that a grab? I think that's a grab, right? 
tries to eat me. Another drop. Purging stone. Might need that. Why not? Because I bought a bunch of at Oswald, I think his name is. And I guess after after the boss fight we can um I can do some what's it called? Just some freeing of Logan. We can actually free him. Maybe he just dies, would be good to um, fine by me, I mean. No drop this time. Are there two three more? Okay. I mean a few too many enemies for my liking here. Ah oh, come on. I got hit again. Stop that. What the? I also like when my attacks don't connect. Another drop. Ooh, twinkling shit. You're first. Really? Of course, stagger or, or buffer the attack. <sighs> Just so annoying. Let's see, maybe... Maybe this one is better. And the Twinkling Titanite shit. There is no means of... Uh, yeah. mm. I hope I don't need as much for... There is not even an item here! There's not even a fucking item here! For some reason I thought there was an item here in this corner. What a waste of time. Holy shit. So, curse. Do I care about curse? Do I? I should. I don't care about physical that much, I think. Maybe a little bit. What is the best against magic so far? 38... That eh, don't care. Put on this, good enough. Good enough. I think. Let's do this. So how does it work again? When does he trigger? He triggers here already. Okay. Oh. Where is Crystal? I wonder what's that doing? Oh boy, here comes the blind dragon! Is he even blind? He has no eyes. Or does he? A very weird angle here. Can't see his eyes. Okay, first thing... I'm... I'm doing one attempt at, the, at tail cutting here. First thing you want to do, get as close as possible to this thing. Doing the right thing, yeah. Yeah, he breaks his own crystal, what an idiot. Then you miss his tail a bunch of times. And now you have the problem, if you want the tail cut. Starts at this side already, okay. Because he's turning constantly. That's the problematic part.
I got two hits and that's good. Ooh. Yeah. Oh, that hurts. Zippy zippy. At least curse is going, is being reduced hard. Can you stop turning, please? The oh, fuck. Can you stop turning, please? Thank you. I yeah, keep keep melee attacking. <laughs> what what a boss fight, right? If you want the tail cut. Amazing. I can't even get over there. And just keep turning, please. It's such a fun fun little thing to do. Wow. Still no tail cut. For some reason I start thinking that uh, I don't even know if the beam deals damage. Oh, great, I missed. Stop turning, you idiot. Oh, he's doing tail shit again. Oh, he turns again. Who cares? I don't. Is it tied to poise or something, the tail? Is it? It must be. It must be tied to poise or something similar. Because, um... It's actually, we can see. It teleports me. Because the same thing with Priscilla, it's not... Is her name Priscilla? Yeah, right? Uh, because she becomes visible again once you break her poise and feels a similar, similar to the tail. Then you need to break the poise of the tail in order to cut it. Because it basically, like, it makes no sense that a tail has so much HP. I should have broken the HP or quote-unquote destroyed the... Or kill the kill the tail when it actually has HP. But maybe you know more more about this, so uh, why not answer it in the comments? I put points into faith. Is faith that important? Not really. More strength, maybe. More dexterity, maybe. And let's just go with HP. <laughs> I don't know. I don't. I don't. Probably don't need more faith. My. What's it called? What's what's it called now? The. Hmm. Sword. It's called a sword. The claymore. That's that's my. My my. Uh, holy weapon that probably deals enough damage and I'm not really using spells all that much what a brave enemy just standing there in my way I'm still the wrong side so what area is the next one tomb of the giants maybe might be a fun one Oh, what's the other one? Isolith. No, thank you. I don't want to do the ice or after this. Or maybe I do because Tomb of the Giants is, in my opinion, definitely the most dangerous one. Because the enemies there are fairly strong. And 
Isolif is just nothing. A lot of nothingness, a lot of eyesore. But it's not difficult. Because most enemies that are in the in the lava over there are just like you're, you're not even fighting them. You're just it's like a visit at a zoo, basically. That's how I would describe it. Oh, for fuck's sake! snakes are coming. Oh, excuse me, that wasn't my intention. I mean the back step. Slogan gone now. Good. I want that sower. Just came for the sower. Firekeeper sower. How did he manage to get out of here without my help? Who knows? I don't. And I don't care. Maybe. Maybe I do care a little bit. Let's see if he is at his location. Shouldn't be the case, but. What do I know? No, he is at his location. Hello there. This place is as promised. I shall share the new so and the Ah, it it the tone. Sorry for skipping a little bit. I don't care. Whatever. Hey, you can buy his sorceries here. I don't want them. Yeah, goodbye. I could fight him in Seif's original area. Maybe I should. Or should I? Should I really? It's on the other side here. That's not that hard to get there. Or is it? No, it's not. It, it's not that hard. But Logan might be a problem. Or maybe not. I don't know if he's a problem or not. He's a mage, every mage is a problem, but... Hmm... Stop shooting me in the back. Alright, is this even the right thing? Oh, he headshot at me. Oh, I'm almost dead, ooh, ooh. Wow, amazing. Where's my... Uh, how do I get the elevator over here? Isn't this the elevator part? Huh? Shouldn't the eleva elevator be here? I was already dead. Can I call it from... I can call it from this side. Very, very well hidden. Uh, Oh, whoa, 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 what's going on with the camera here? Seizure inducing. Hello, goodbye. No, you. No, I'm not fighting this dude. He's too slow. I'm too fast. Let's go. Uh, I don't care about the item over there. All right, let's see. Open up, open up. Let's see if Logan is here. If not, I don't care anymore. I'm going into the tomb of the giants. Or am I? Nah, let's go Isolif next. Hello. Oh, no Logan here. 
don't care. Give me that. And then there should be a soul up here somewhere. I wonder what what, what, what Seif is doing all the time, like, uh, like when he's just sitting there. And first of all, how did he get out of here? There seems to... the ceiling seems to be intact. Was there a window? Let me see, is there a window somewhere over here? Might be behind me, but... Oh, I like how the entrance is just pitch black. Looks very realistic, guys. Sort of a hero, nice, nice. There it might be the big opening. No, it's how did how did Seif get out of here? That doesn't seem to be a a hole in the roof. Ah, magic, I guess. How does Seif even? Like he has these three tentacles for some reason as a dragon, three tentacles as a base, and then this, these two small wings, and with the wings he, he, he can fly with these, with the chicken wings, apparently he can. Um, walk to... Daughter of Chaos, there we go. Right, I need to I need to sacrifice my Hmm Do I have enough humanity? I technically do have enough humanity. Hmm. I'm thinking a little bit. Do I care about that? Because what I could do is I could join her covenant, give her 30 humanity, so that the, for some reason, the shortcut to Isolith is accessible and then I could just approach the area from from the back why would I do this to save Solaire hmm oh fuck it why not hmm But wait, I have an idea. Fire, fire is nice. Let's first of all go to the filing shrine. I have, I have an idea. Fire might be, but might be very useful later on. But for that, I need souls. So first of all, let me enhance the estus. There, reinforce, please. I don't have a fifth one, or a second one in that case, good, or not good, whatever. And we have Sieglinde here. Oh, hello again. Widow's managing quite well, aren't they? But I haven't found my father yet. Have you seen him? Uh... No... No, yes, I, I did. Doesn't matter, let's say yes. I'm sorry he's caused you trouble. Because I've seen him down below the last time, I guess. Maybe she's referring to that. Yeah, I don't care. Don't care about Briggs or whatever his name is. Do care about this dude, I don't. Anyways. Well, I see you made it out. Yeah, I, I made it out safely too. I have my pyromancy of the Great Swamp, so I can usually manage with a bit of care. Oh yeah. By the way, uh, I can share my spells with you. I think you have a knack for it. All you need are the materials. I'll be pleased to help you. Ah, uh, unless you find the magics unsavory. See? 
I don't f no, I don't find them find them unsavory. Yeah, wonderful. Good. I'm sure that you know they'll be of some use, some assistance. Here, first take this. Thank you. A flame from the great swamp. Now you're a fully fledged pyromancer. Well, let's get started right now. Okay. You can purchase some stuff here. Nothing major. Uh, let me buy everything you have. Modify. And then this just requires some souls. Like quite a few souls. Goodbye then. Come back. I'm, I'm coming back, but first let me use uh, not these uh, these souls. Twenty thousand, very nice. Ooh, I have quite a lot of souls here. Should be thirty. Yeah, nice, nice. Oh, I have ten of the brave, brave warrior souls. So maybe, maybe sixteen. Okay, let's see. Oh, hello. Oh, please, as always. Let's keep modifying. Okay, he needs more. Oh, more souls. Okay, let's pump everything in that. Fifty thousand, that's good. Another fifteen. Let's use these three. That is just three thousand. Get my and the last bit. Twenty-two thousand. All right. Oh, well, I'm oh, pleased as always. Let's modify a bit more. Sixteen, nineteen, twenty-two, and a final twenty-five. Goodbye then. Come back. Oh, that is expensive, dude. Holy shit. That is indeed expensive. But I could now just use this one. Do I see the uh, 190? It's definitely decent. So what weapon do I want to use, by the way? Because we're going into a fire area. Lightning spear, eh. Uh, should I upgrade the Great Scythe? Make it a lightning weapon? Because I remember in this game the Scythe is good. It's quite the decent moveset. At least it was. Uh, maybe this one. I enjoy the Hallbird. Let's upgrade this one. Um, reinforce. Uh, Hallbird is further down. Two. Where is it? Um. Where is it? They're on un that parish. Ah. On that parish. Right. Okay. Andre. Hello. Well, I've never heard of a black ember. Hmm. How about leaving that ember with me? I find it 
strangely fascinating. Sure. Yes, this ember really is something special. I'm already under its spell. I sense great potential, indeed. I think that's for occult weapons. Yeah. Yeah, that's for occult. Okay. So, oh, I just have one large titanite. Oh. Don't get yourself neither of Well, I guess I'm not using that thing then. Um, back to this one. And now, um, hmm, where to? Where's Warp? There's Warp. Then the dot of chaos. There should be fourteen. I have sixteen. I need to use fourteen more. I think it was 30. Uh, enter Covenant. Join, sure. And of a humanity, let's go with 10 first. Let's see if I can get anything here. Okay, let's offer 20 more, uh, 10 more, is it doing anything, let's see, nope, the final 10, I don't know if I can open it now, but I got some spells. Which is nice, I guess. I tune spells. Put them in. I put one in because chaos ones, chaos spells need more. Pyromancy flame is already equipped. So I guess I'm ready to go. I'm ready to go into Isolith. Yeah, let's, let's go to the other bonfire there. And then I'm going to end the episode. So I wonder how much... Uh, probably just one more episode. Like... I'm, I'm pretty sure that I'm... That I can finish the demon ruins in, in one go. Right? There's like three bosses. One of them is shit. Two of them are shit. One is reskin. So technically all of them are shit. But oh well. <laughs> I've been talking for a bit too long. This episode was a bit too long for my liking, but... Well, here's the end. Hope you had fun. I definitely had some fun. <laughs> and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.